Andy, when did you uh, first get started uh, with the Apple III at Apple? Oh, just uh, maybe a few weeks after I started working there in August 1979, uh, I saw this prototype that a uh, technician named Dan Kotke was building on his workbench along with Wendell Sander, the designer of the machine. In those days, they would be changing the hardware every day because the design of the machine wasn't frozen. And uh, since I was interested in all these new features uh, the hardware had, I'd help them by testing out the new feature the day they got it going. Now, one of the things you'd mentioned was the uh, running horses display. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Yeah, that was, uh, well, that I did that to uh, test out the downloadable character set feature in the Apple III just a few days after they first put it in. I was thinking, well, what, what impressive thing can I get up on the screen that would be very hard to do without that? And I conceived that, God, putting all these colored horses all running at once would be too much to plot on the high-risk screen, but, but with the downloaded character set, I could make 16 horses run as quickly as just one by downloading the characters. So I, so I uh, got these nice bitmaps that Charlie Kellner had digitized uh, from, actually, that was originally from uh, this guy named Charles Mudridge or, or Mulberry or something doing uh, motion studies in the early part of the century, and, and that's where they were originally uh, gotten from, and Charlie had digitized them for a program on the Apple II called Animatrix, and so I just converted them into a character set format and wrote the appropriate software to download them. Another, what people don't know is, we said the running horses is the most famous, but there's another um, sort of spin-off of that program was uh, a, tur a turkey vulture. Um, uh, also, there was also an animation of that, but that's not as commonly known. <laughs> Love to get a copy of that <laughs> from somewhere. <laughs> I'm okay. Machine status normal.